In this short video, we will show you how to set up communication between your IQ computer and your satellite controller. First, we will need the IP address for your router. If you do not know what it is, open a command window and type ipconfig space slash all and press enter. The IP address is the default gateway. If you plan on using a public IP address for your NCC cartridge or not use the internet at all, just a direct local connection, you will not have to set up port forwarding. If you are using a network that will use an internet connection and an NCC cartridge using a private IP address, you will have to set up port forwarding on your router before you continue. I will be using a typical Netgear router, but the tabs and field entries are pretty similar for most routers. Open a web browser and enter the router's IP address in the address bar. Enter the username and password for the router. The default login is usually found in the supplied instructions. First, we will show you how to use the DHCP reservation feature to permanently save an IP address for your cartridge. Select the Attach Devices menu to see what IP addresses are available. You cannot have multiple IP addresses assigned to the same device, so we can use this list to make sure we assign a valid IP address to our cartridge. Note all the IP addresses currently in use. Next, we will add a DHCP reservation based on the MAC address of our cartridge. The MAC address is listed on a sticker on the back of the NCC Ethernet cartridge. On our router, we will go to the Setup LAN Setup page. Now we will click Add. and enter a valid unused IP address and the cartridge MAC address. Also, add a descriptive device name and click Add. This IP address is now reserved for your cartridge. Find the port forwarding screen, commonly found other something similar to port forwarding, applications and gaming, virtual servers, or advanced settings. Create a custom entry by adding the following information. Field labels may vary slightly, but the info is the same for all routers. Application or service name. Enter Rainbird IQ in a name field. Protocol. Select either TCP or both TCP slash UDP options. Ports. Enter 5005 in all port fields. IP address. Enter any valid IP address that will not conflict with other devices on the network. Save the entry by selecting a Save or Apply Settings button.
Now we need to use the NCC Configurator software to assign an IP address to the NCC cartridge. Refer to this diagram to connect your cartridge to the IQ computer. Then follow these steps to activate the IQ software config mode. For more information, check the IQ help files or the resources section of the Rainbird IQ website. Now start the NCC configurator. IP address. Enter the IP address entered during the custom entry step. Default gateway. Enter your router's private IP address. For wireless cartridges, enter the SSID and password for your local wireless network. Then press the send configuration button. Use the IQ software to set up a satellite using the default gateway address and the port number of 50005. First, add a satellite. Choose the satellite type, then the IQNet type. Click OK. Now click the Edit Configuration and Stations button. Enter the IP address assigned to the cartridge and the port number. If you want to access the controller from outside the local network, use the external IP address of the router. You can go to Google and type in what's my IP address to get your external router IP address. Click OK to finish. For more information, check the IQ help files or the resources section of the Rainbird IQ website. The Rainbird IQ Enterprise Central Control System Another example of the intelligent use of water. To learn more, please visit www.rainbird.com.